The Senate Committee on Public Account on Wednesday queried the Central Bank of Nigeria, CBN, over an alleged missing $3.3 billion, approximately 1.2 trillion naira. The amount was said to be unaccounted for from the $21.3 billion remitted to the Apex Bank by the Federal Inland Revenue Service, the FIRS, as foreign tax in 2015. The query was sent by the Office of the Auditor General of the Federation to the Senate Committee. The Auditor General wrote in a query that while the FIRS recorded $21.3 billion as the amount collected as foreign tax in 2015 from the CBN, the Apex Bank, on the other hand, recorded it as $18 billion. But the representative of the bank, its deputy governor of corporate affairs, Edward Adamu, explained that the differences in the figures were due to the changes in exchange rate. The $3.3 billion is neither missing nor unremitted, but the difference is due to variations of exchange rate during, during the time, he explained. But the committee disputed this. The chairman of the committee, Matthew Irogide, PDP Edo, mandated the bank to reappear before the panel next month next Monday with documents detailing the said variations in exchange rate. Joining us live is Gideon Ojo, financial expert. Thank you, Mr. Ojo, for joining us on the news. It's a pleasure. Thanks for having me. Happy Friday. I, ne I need you to quickly interpret issues like this. How do you begin to interpret situations like this? Well, um, it looks like the more you look, the less you see. How could you receive... Uh, $21 billion, and then you convert into exchange rate, and then you are recording $18 billion. Um, I think we need to be sure whether this has been the standard practice with Central Bank of Nigeria. And um, the two parties, the Federal Inland Revenue Services and then the Central Bank of Nigeria, including the Minister of Finance, needs to be queried alongside. You recall that it's actually the Office of Auditor General that exposed this, this differential. I, I, it would be interesting to know whether this has been the standard practice that when you receive dollar, you convert it, and then instead of you to have increase, you are having a decrease. I think there should have been an increase. If, if, if you receive dollar, uh, $21.3 billion. And given our exchange rate, it should actually be much more given the exchange rate than reducing. All right, Mr. The Mr. Ojo, for, these Mr. are Ojo, foreign tax. Yeah, does this it's speak, not, it's does this speak to processes? Mr. Ojo, does this speak to processes and procedures, or is this an issue of accountability? It is both. It's both issue of processes and accountability. That's why I said, does this follow the standard procedures, standard operating procedures of Central Bank of Nigeria? That, you know, what, what is contradictory for me is basically that if you, if you receive dollar from Federal Revenue Services, that's what we are told. They receive $21.3 billion as for as a foreign tax from FRS, and then you are recording, you are making entry of $18 billion. That is curious, because at least I know if you do the conversion to Naira, it should actually be much more than that $21.3 billion. It should not be less. For you to now be saying that the $3.3 billion not remitted is neither stolen nor misappropriated, let them come forward with proper documentation. I think there is uh, something very uh, untidy in the whole process. Mr. Gideon Joe, thank you for joining us on the news and for your contribution. It's a pleasure. Thanks for having me.